sorry about a mad doctor who brings a sex monster to life. Let's enjoy a clip. It's alive! <laughs> Alright, well, if he's alive, let's do this. Saucy. But what's this guy got to do with Lips? She is the new co-star in her next project called The Canyons. Wait a minute, like a porn star's? Yes. It's not a porn, it's a regular film. So he's crossing over. Why, is he a big actor? Uh, yes. But back to Lindsay. She's got another project, that's a big deal. Interesting. Yeah, The Canyons, and she's doing that Lifetime movie, Liz and Dick, which, despite the title, is not a porno. She's just got two things going at once. So did the girl in f***ing starring. Just saying. What up, man? How you doing? Good. I'm Makai Pfeiffer, leaving LAX. Uh, we ask... Do you, think, do you think you got more girls when you had dreads or when you didn't have dreads? <laughs> Without the dreads. Without the dreads? Why? Why is that? Wow. How can girls don't feel dreads, do you think? And he said something kind of interesting. I don't know. I mean, you feel like you look a little dirty or something. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you did something, and I don't know what exactly you did, but you did something, and I can't... Now, I think he's just losing weight. That, that shirt really is very slimming. No, it's not that. There's, he did something to his hair. Wash this? No, it's, there, it's different. It's a little poofy right now, isn't it? You did something this weekend, didn't you? No. You went to that place, didn't you? That place? What's the the place? place where, you know, you get your dreads done. It's, it's called a hair. It's called a hair. Never mind. The dread, the dread store. <laughs> 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 June 25th, 2012. Today marks the three-year anniversary of the death of Michael Jackson, and already so much has changed. His kids have moved in with his mother, numerous doctors have been exposed for sucking up to celebrities, and the man who killed Michael is on the hunt for serial killers in Sweden! If you believe his baby mama... We've got video of Nicole Alvarez. She talks about how he is escaping jail by uh, teleporting himself to different places through reading. Wow. He's able to uh, transport himself to all these different places like Sweden or Paris or Afghanistan. And apparently he's read over 60 books in jail, including the girl with the dragon tattoo. Yeah, but that's weird. What's weird? That he's using his imagination to pretend he's not in jail? With